If you're currently shopping around for a good explant surgeon, then you're probably quickly realizing how long you're gonna have to wait just to even get a consultation, let alone then schedule your explant surgery. Plastic surgeons who are well known in doing explants properly and who are very popular in the breast implant illness community are currently on anywhere from a six month to a year and a half wait. And when you're going through breast implant illness, waiting that long to remove your breast implants feels like an eternity. In this video, I'm gonna share with you three ways to possibly explant months sooner than your original explant date. And if you're new to my channel, hello, I am Christina, the founder of Sized Happy, the admin of the best. Facebook group on Facebook, Breast Implant Illness, Rejuvenation and Education with Christina. And you can also find me on Instagram at I am size happy. One of these tips that I'm about to share with you actually allowed me to explant four months sooner than my original explant surgery date. So what happened was I scheduled my consultation in July and I scheduled my surgery date for November. And at the time there was like a four month wait for the surgeon that I was going to. Right now I think that same surgeon is at like a year long wait because you know, more women are wanting to do explants. But in July, scheduled my surgery for November. I was like, oh my gosh, I have to wait four months. And that just feels like an eternity when you know that what's inside of you is poisoning you and what's really making you sick. So, Again, just kind of like dealt with it. I'm like, okay, you know, I'll explant in four months. It's gonna go by quick. But then one morning I woke up, it was a Monday, and there was a surgery date open for that same Thursday. So I went from waiting four months to my surgery to one morning waking up, and now I'm like four days to my surgery. And I'm gonna share with you the three tips that you should be doing if you're really wanting to get your explant surgery bumped up sooner. And I wanna start off by saying that just because an explant surgeon that you're considering isn't like well known on social media and might not even have some social media channels, it doesn't mean that they are not qualified to do your explant surgery properly. I do have a video on here about like how to explant, what an explant surgery should look like and how to choose the best explant surgeon. So go find those videos after this one. But I do want to say that just because they're not on social media doesn't mean they don't know what they're doing. At the end of the day, they're plastic surgeons. They're not influencers. Tip number one, when you go to your explant surgery consultation, ask your explant surgeon, do you have a wait list? So a wait list is like you set your explant surgery date and if they have an opening pop up, they will call you because you'll be on the wait list. So see if they have a wait list. If so, definitely get on there if you are able to um, get your explant surgery sooner. I know some women like they have to wait until summertime or they have to wait until like after an event or anything like that. But if your schedule is pretty open and you have the means, then definitely put yourself on the wait list and see if you can get your explant surgery sooner. While you're at your explant surgery consultation, it's always a mouthful for me. See if your explant surgeon has a Facebook group on Facebook. So typically this is an exclusive Facebook group just for that surgeon and just for that surgeon's um, patients who are gonna be going through an explant surgery. I know of a handful of surgeons right off the top of my head who do have Facebook groups and women who are considering them or who have already used them are in that group. And it's just a great place to have community and be able to ask questions like, hey, does this look normal? Or what does this surgeon like to do um, after a surgery? Or should I be doing that? And you just have like a community of women who are also going through this with you with that particular surgeon. And tip number three, and this is actually how I got my explant surgery bumped up, is see if your surgeon is on Instagram. So Instagram is a really great um, platform for plastic surgeons, specifically like explant surgeons, to show like their patient's transformation, so to say, for lack of a better word, um, to show that they're doing the explant surgery properly. You know, they're gonna show the implants on the table with the capsules removed. 
Um, you know, they're gonna do educational videos, stuff like that. But Instagram, I know a lot of really popular um, plastic surgeons in the BII community who are specializing in explants are on Instagram. I followed my um, aqua plastic surgery. I followed their account during the time that I was waiting for my explant surgery. And one morning I woke up and I looked at the stories of aqua plastic surgeries um, Instagram account and there was a story that said you know we have an opening for this Thursday the patient didn't check out you know if you'd like to grab this spot then please contact the patient coordinator so like I jumped on that and I was like you know I called and I was like can they do an explant surgery that day and she told me yes and I was like oh my gosh like I woke up this morning thinking I'm still having to wait four months for my surgery and like I could get it done this week. So definitely follow your surgeon on social media if they do have an account because, and also check their stories obviously, because there are some outlets like that, like the Instagram and in the Facebook group to where they will make a post saying, hey, you know, we have an opening this Thursday or we have an opening on this date. Does anybody want to take it? So those are the top three ways to potentially get your explant surgery date bumped up. You want to be making sure that you follow your explant surgeons like social media outlets really closely if they do have a social media outlet. Obviously, if they don't have a social media outlet, if that's just not maybe their strong suit, then see if they do have a wait list and make sure that you get on that wait list. And if you are getting ready to explant very soon, check out the 18 step explant checklist. I will link this down below. And if you just discovered breast implant illness and you're wanting to know like, what do I need to do? Cause there's a lot of information out there, but like, what do I just need to do to get to my explant surgery date? Check out discovering breast implant illness. What now? I will link this down in the comments below as well. And if you found this video helpful, please like it, give me a comment and make sure you're subscribed and I will see you on the next video.